Hello YouTube. I went to the gym this morning and when I got home there was a package waiting for me on the doorstep. Um, I know exactly what's in it and I'm quite excited about it. I've been waiting for this to come now for a little over a week. So let's not waste any time and let's open up and see what's inside. You might remember on International Pipe Smoking Day, uh, smokingpipes.com had 10% off of uh, everything on site, on their site, I should say, and uh, I took advantage of it. There was a pipe I was looking, have been looking at for about four or five months. Not cheap by any means, so that's why it took me a long time to hum and haw about getting it. But I finally got around to it. I thought the 10% was too, uh, too much to pass up, so I immediately logged on the site and purchase this pipe. And I've been waiting, I've been, as I said, I've been looking at this pipe for quite some time and uh, thinking about it and whether or not I should purchase it, but I just couldn't say no, I, I had to get it. So they've got it wrapped up pretty good here, as you can see. Smokingpipes.com. Lots of bubble wrap. It made it through customs no problem. I was worried because it was a little bit more expensive than normal that they may charge me uh, for importing it, but no problem whatsoever. Got here on time, very excited about it. And let's take a look at it. So I don't know if this is the original box. Smokingpipes.com has put a sticker over top of it, but it's uh, it looks like the original box. I believe Ashton Pipes have um, come in of this very sleek black box. I've seen other boxes like, or other unboxings of Ashton Pipes on um, YouTube, and they always come in a really nice sleek black box. And of course, we have peanuts inside. They're very good at protecting their product, smokingpipes.com. Let's get rid of those. And here we are. I don't know if you can see that on there, on this white bag. It says Ashton pipes where is it yeah I'm not sure if you can see that or not maybe you can I can sort of see it and let's take a look I've been really excited about this pipe okay you ready there we go this is the first time I've seen seeing it other than on the internet so I'm pretty excited right now I've got to admit oh yeah look at that that is sweet. Nice pebble grain. I guess you could call that a ring grain around the pipe. There's the details on the bottom of it. I hope those show up. Ashton Triple X. It's a pretty big pipe. It's about six and a half inches in length. Of course, it's got that really nice blast on it. You can see the ring grain. I believe that's called a ring grain, a ring grain or a pebble grain. I can't, re I can't remember, but it's got a, uh, rings around it, so I assume that would be called a ring grain. I hope the camera's picking up, picking it up, because in real time here, it looks quite wonderful. And you could see why they uh, decided to blast it. It's got these little dings on the side, but I, I like that. I think it gives a character, and uh, it's got a pretty deep bowl. And I wanted something like this, a nice clash, classic English pipe. I really like that, that style. I know a lot of guys go for that stubby poker look now, and I mean, if that's what you like, all the power to you. But for me, I like that, that long, classic English style of pipe. And I really like billiards. Billiards are my favorite by far. I don't mind uh, bent pipes now and then. I, actually, on my two outdoor smokes, you've seen bent pipes. Uh, I think they're a little easier to talk with when you have a bent pipe, but... If you're smoking on your own or whatnot, I really like billiards. And this blast is great. You can see on the bottom where they started the blast and how it sort of made its way up. Just terrific. I've, as I said, I've been in love with this pipe for about four or five months. Ever since I first saw it, I thought, God, I really want that pipe. But of course, it, it's Ashton Pipes, as is, is, uh, most of you probably know, are on the pricey side. But 10% off, I just couldn't say no. I just thought it was just too nice. And you can see the dot there, the, 
that uh, denotes it's an Ashton pipe. Once again, you can see the detail underneath. It's just great. Really like this. So it says Pebble Green on it, made in England. And it's got the three axes. So again, it's about six and a half inches. So that's a pretty good size for a pipe. I really like that. Yeah, I think it'll be, this is gonna be terrific. Really happy with this. Uh, I thought about getting a Dunhill pipe, but you know, people say you know Dunhills are overrated. You don't get what you pay for. I don't know if Ashton is better or worse than a Dunhill pipe. I really don't know enough about them, but I uh, I just like the look. I thought it was great, and it was a little bit cheaper than what a Dunhill pipe would have been. I'm very happy with it. Looks great. And I mean, again, look at how deep that bowl is. That'll give you a good hour-long smoke at least. It's great. Yes. Quite terrific. Thank you very much, smokingpipes.com. Very happy about this. And it's, yeah, as I said, it's got a good size to it. It's got a good weight, so, you know, if it doesn't work as a pipe, I guess I could always just bludgeon a man to death with it. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll post another video here very soon. I've got a tobacco box opening coming up. It should be here any day. Some new tobaccos that uh, I'm wanting to try that uh, other veteran pipe smokers have recommended. Ones that I don't think are very popular, ones that people don't often talk about, but came recommended by veteran pipe smokers, so I'll do that here in the next couple of days. But anyway, thanks for uh, tuning in. Thanks for watching. All my new subscribers, thank you very much. I hope the camera shows this pipe to be as nice as it looks in real time, because this is a beauty. Really is. It's got it's black, but it's got this light red shade underneath. It's really quite nice. Anyway, once again, thank you very much for watching, uh, and I'll talk to you very soon.